For Honor, Nobushi, Weapon Review. Anyway, this hero has a uh, kind of controversial name. <laughs> um, I sometimes call it No BS. Um, anyway, <laughs> let's get on to the moveset for her. Um, and uh, other, than, other than that, also a little bit of strategy and tips for her. Anyway, she's a hybrid, and I'd say sh <laughs> she has the best range out of all of the heroes so far. Um, <laughs> now some come close, like the, uh, like the Lawbringer and the Valkyrie, and and maybe even the Conqueror, but and, and can say, but no, no BS is the one with the uh, longest range uh, in the game. Anyway. The first, uh, like, attack-chain combo is the most annoying and the most recognized, poke the nest. It's basically three light attacks right in a row, pow, 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 and the last light attack gives off the bleed effect. And, uh, yeah. This is chainable, so I'd say you can probably do a poke, th poke the nest, but then uh, hit RT after doing one, l like, do four... Uh, do the poke nest and uh, poke the nest, and then do the second one, which is hiss and bite, uh, which is a light attack and a heavy attack. So you probably do three light attacks, a fourth light attack, and a heavy, doing that combo, and then do another two heavies, doing the that rattle rattle form, which is another chain attack. And uh, anyway, other than that, there's the slithering thrust, which is kind of like um, like how some characters, before they actually, like, get into guard mode to engage in combat, they actually do a small attack. And this one is no different, the only thing is, you sprint, you hit the light attack button, and you get the bleed effect on there. Which is very good. Then you have Coiling Slash, which is same thing, only that it's with the heavy attack and it does not make the bleed. Then you have Hidden Stance. This is pretty interesting, so you, very tactical. While you're in guard mode, you can actually hold your uh, stance and hide your, uh, no, where you're guarding uh, to your enemy. So th that's pretty sneaky. Then you have the Cobra, sh cro cobra Strike, which is dodge in, uh, in any direction other than backwards. And hit the light attack button, and you get a little attack which will give a little bit of the bleed effect. Then you have the Cobra Strike mix up. You have to grab the, uh, how do you call it, um, uh, guard break an opponent, like it has to hit, and then throw them, like double tap the X button. I'm on console, so, the uh, like Xbox, so double tap the X and then hit the light attack button and you'll get the Cobra mix up which will give you the bleed effect then you go to the Viper's retreat which is uh, while you're moving backwards you can hit a light attack which will give you a little bit of a bleed effect before you run away then you have the Sidewinder form which is dodging sideways and light attack and then swift recoil which is kind of the escape protocol yeah, when you block somebody, hit the A, and you can dodge out of there quickly. Anyway, what I was saying, like about all those bleed effects, like like Nobushi is like the queen of bleeding or something. Um, is this small perk, uh, way of the shark? Uh, it's not a feat or anything. It's hero specific. Um, do extra damage when hitting someone that's already being affected by the bleed effect. Now that is something good because. You can get the first attack you ever get with a bleed, and then you can keep on making them bleed with that uh, poke the nest, and do that crazy combo, then probably a crowbar from tree, and you can mix it up all crazy with the bleed effect. And also with all the flashing on the red on the enemy side when they get the bleed effect, you'll probably distract them or just you know disrupt them. And I'd say that's quite a lot on Onobushi. Other than that, she has a low health pool, a very good amount of stamina and also her uh, passive feat the first one is infinite lungs which is pretty helpful since you might run out of stamina here and then and you really need to just get out of there
But anyway, smack that like button, hit the sub, drop the comment, and I'll see you guys later for another video on the channel. I'm out of here.